The incredible surprise that Heidi Klum is speaking out for the very first time about her soon-to-be ex-husband's claim that she was sleeping with their bodyguard. But first, the showbiz countdown begins tonight with the top three Jessica Simpson shockers revealed today on the debut of Katie Couric's new show. Kicking things off at number three, of course, the big reveal. It was Jessica, for the very first time, revealing her post-baby body after gaining all that weight. Please welcome Jessica Simpson. Exciting. I, I almost peed my pants, I have to be honest. So, there you saw it. And here's our showbiz flashpoint. Did Jessica live up to the hype? With me tonight from Hollywood, Heather Dubrow. She's from the Real Housewives of Orange County. Heather's also a mother of four. With me in New York, Erica Petrini. Erica's a TV host and a mother of two. So I expect great insight from you ladies. And Erica, I'm going to start with you. <laughs> what did you think? Did she live up to the hype after all this waiting to finally see her post-baby body? You know, maybe not for some, but for all the mothers out there dealing with their infants, their sleepless nights, not able to get to the gym, no nutritionists, no trainers, none of that, this is the exactly the Jessica Simpson they wanted to see. Someone honest about the fact that it's hard, it's really hard, yeah. and you know, that it's not just gonna, even if you're a celebrity, it doesn't just fall off like that. And let's remember, part of the hype was her dropping some hints, not two subtle hints sure. that she was having a struggle losing the weight so maybe our expectations weren't that she was going to walk out somehow stick thin in, in your mind heather did she live up to the hype i think she did i mean honestly i think it would have been disturbing if she came out in a bikini yeah. um i think she came off as very relatable and great and one thing that i was really happy about is that i mean even though it was sort of a running commercial for weight watchers she's promoting you know healthy eating which is i think a really great message to send to women in america and really being relatable about all that pressure you guys know all too well the pressure on new moms and celebrity moms it's even tougher for them because of course they're in the spotlight when they have to lose all that weight after having a baby that takes us to number two on our showbiz countdown of simpson shockers from her big reveal today it was jessica's confession to katie kirk that she actually agrees that, yeah, there's too much pressure on new moms. Let's watch that together. Do you think that's putting a lot of pressure on all women to Absolutely. kind of have unrealistic and I, goals? And I've been the woman that's looked at the magazines like, oh my gosh, how in the world did she do that? <laughs> like, I, you know, now being in that position, um, you know, I, I put on more baby weight than I was planning on putting on. So um, I think that I really have to separate myself from the world's expectations. Yeah, and besides feeling a whole lot of pressure to lose the weight, you know, Jessica is also being paid a reported three to four million dollars to front the Weight Watchers new ad campaign. Erica, do you think, I don't know, we've been talking about this really since she, she had the baby. All the pressure could possibly backfire on Jessica because that can make it harder to lose the weight. Yeah, absolutely. But there's something I have to disagree. You said it. you think it's harder on celebrity moms. I, I have to disagree. And that's where I got lost in the interview. And I th started really believing that Jessica was this everyday woman. And she's not. She's got nutritionists. And she's got, you know, a team of people helping her out. I think it's actually harder for the everyday woman who doesn't have that sort of support. support. So I can't really feel too, too bad for her. She does got this, she has this great deal. And... And weren't we, wouldn't it be nice if we were all that lucky? Yeah, well, and, and to be clear about my point, it wasn't that it is harder for the celebrity moms to lose the weight. It's harder in terms of the amount of pressure because perhaps for true, some, true, that's because true. they're on television with that spotlight shining on them every day. Yeah. Heather, let me get your take. You're a reality TV star. You're an actress. You know something about this. You've, you've dealt with it before. What do you think? Well, I think it's crazy pressure. I mean, honestly, you know, as an actor, you know, you, you're, admit you're supposed to look a certain way and we, there's a lot of pressure to always look thin and great. And then someone gives you permission to eat for nine months. And a lot of us tend to go overboard and then pulling it back in is really difficult. And you know, look, there's two sides to it. Of course, it's a lot easier when someone's writing you a, a seven figure check to get motivated, but mm -hmm. also there is a lot of pressure with everyone looking at you. It's hard to, to bounce back and you've got postpartum and you've got this little baby to take care of. It's a lot. Yeah, but she was so relatable talking about how much she, she did gain, which was neat to hear. Yeah. She said when she was pregnant, at one point she weighed more than 170 pounds before she gave birth to her daughter, and that was back on May 1st. Oh, we've all been there. Yeah, exactly. Well, <laughs> that's right. But she was here, very honest, though. It was refreshing. But here's the thing that I think a lot of people actually wanted to hear from her today, how much weight 
she actually she lost. Went. Now, that takes us to number one in right. our showbiz countdown of Sins and Shockers today. Well, guess what? Jessica refused to tell Katie Couric exactly how much weight she lost. <laughs> I love it. All she would say is that it has been at least 40 pounds. Erica, does it even matter how much weight she lost so far? Because people well, you know, really, people <laughs> like it or not, people wanted to know the number. Right. Well, it matters probably for her contract, but it matters in very little to us. <laughs> you know what I mean? We all just wanted to see: did she look good or didn't she look? Didn't she look good? And the number business, that's for her to deal with with Weight Watchers. We don't care so much about that. Well, that new Weight I agree Watchers. With that. Yeah, go, I'm sorry. Go ahead, Heather. I agree with that. And it's funny, you know, I was just reading an article today that Pink gave this interview and she was saying, you know, her baby's 15 months old and she's still 10 pounds from her pre-baby weight, but Hell she yeah. looks phenomenal and she's healthy and she's athletic. And I don't think the, the number really matters. No. Sometimes you're more curvaceous in the right places. Yeah. And the great thing is, look. And look your at, body changes. Yeah. And, and look at the dialogue that's happening as a result of, uh, you know, <laughs> I don't think, look, we've paid attention to celebrity babies and, and body weight issues with celebrities before, but I've never seen so much focus post baby and where the weight's going. So that new Weight Watchers commercial we've been talking about was revealed today during Katie's show. But we just see her face. I mean, look at this. This is the commercial. We're not seeing any full body view. Definitely no bikini shots like we see in the other celebrity Weight Watcher loss ad, or weight loss ads. Uh, Jessica tells Katie that was intentional. Watch what she said about that. I really didn't want it to be about my weight because I know that everybody has their weight and has their own issues. And I really wanted it to be about the spirit of Weight Watchers and how I was feeling. And I wanted to talk directly to people. So um, it didn't want the like big body reveal moment. It's just not, it's not really who, who I am. And Weight Watchers was on board with that, thankfully. So Jessica says that Weight Watchers was comfortable with Jessica not revealing or showing her exact weight loss, but her words, I didn't want it to be about my weight. Now, you know there are people out there, Erica, who are watching this today and who saw that commercial saying, you don't want it to be about your weight, it's a weight loss ad and you're being paid $4 million. That doesn't add up. Well, first of all, how many times did they say Weight Watchers in the course of the segment? That's well, there's that. <laughs> no, but they, you know, the <laughs> truth is, the like, yeah, exactly. But the truth is, is like she dressed that perfectly because I was thinking the same thing. I'm like, let's let's see what's happening here. But she was so good about the way she delivered that message and said, no, this is about me talking to the camera. And the truth is, it's a great before, right? We still don't, we haven't seen it yet, so we're still waiting. And it, it we're, you know, it's gonna give us more to look for, I suppose. It'll play itself out. Heather, did it surprise you that she didn't show the full body shot and that she really wanted to, well, it, she said she wanted to focus did. on other things. I don't know if that was just the rationalization they were well, using. Well, then or don't sign the a contract with Weight Watchers if you want to focus on other things. I think the bottom line is, you know, she wants to show that she's having a struggle, she's relatable, she's gone on this program and she's losing the weight carefully and in a healthy way. And I think that whole message is good. But to, you know, have a Weight Watchers commercial from here up and say, I want to focus on other things. That just, it, it seems a little hanky to me. Something's missing there. Yeah, yeah. I, I mean, I, and I, look, I, I like her and I still appreciate what she did here and I want to applaud her for focusing on the other sides of it. I have a feeling Absolutely. a lot of people, though, were, were a little surprised by that today. Okay, Heather, Erica, I appreciate you both being here with your special insight tonight. And Thank now that you. we have seen Jessica's big reveal, well, I want to turn it over to you. Here's our Showbiz Tonight exclusive poll. Jessica Simpson reveals her new body on Katie. Does her weight loss effort inspire you? I'd love for you to vote at hlntv.com slash showbiz tonight. You can always send me an email. I'll read that on the air. Send it to showbiz tonight at hlntv.com. Well, here's another.